Okay, so I may be getting cut off just a little bit here, but that's not important. And the reason we shot a few other clips before this clip, and we're going to cut to them here, is I'm using the Panasonic FC1000 camera right now, and it was in this pouch here, and I'm using this microphone and a 10-foot custom Mogami cable that was in this microphone holder here. And then the first clip I shot, let me grab the camera, whoops, I shot with this RX100 Mark IV Sony, also in 4K. That was when she was turning around and showing you everything. And let me just put this, this goes back in here, in that pouch. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go pouch by pouch and show you everything that's in this kit, because people have been asking for this and asking for this, so we're going to give them what they want. So, and by the way, this is Audrey. Audrey? Oh, I'm just a silent woman. Hi, my name is Audrey Shear, and uh, I have a YouTube channel, Hooping Live. Um, if you check out my show every Monday night at 9 p.m. Eastern USA time, I'm talking too much, and that's not important. And... And Audrey, this is difficult for Audrey to do this. Audrey is tiny, okay? And you can't really tell from the camera how tiny she is. But I have a 32-inch waist, and this is set up for me, this think tank, and it fits tight around my waist at 32 inches. And she's doing everything she can to keep this from falling down off of her hips onto the ground because she's so tiny. I'm using the power of the hip <laughs> Yeah, so she's trying her best. So bear with us here. Um, over here, this is probably the most important aspect. Turn a little bit so they can see this spider holster. So this is the spider holster, and this is my Sony uh, A7S Mark II, A7S Mark II. And this is a Gordy's, a custom Gordy's strap. And this, believe it or not, is a dog leash that is on here that is continuing the strap. And I can disconnect it very easily with the little latch for the dog leash. So this is a really handy situation. I like handy. I like things that are, you like things that are handy? You are a handy kind of man. Okay, so if we take this out of here, you see the pin on this side goes right into this receptacle here, and that way it takes, there's no weight on her shoulder here. This strap is not putting any weight, it's just there for safety. So like, for example, if she was drawing it out and she let go of it, it's not gonna hit the ground, all right? But so that's either. really just there for safety. So then she can pull this up and she can shoot 4K video clips with this handheld because of the five axis image stabilization and the stabilized lens. This is a 24 to 70 F4 lens. And this little fuzzy thing here is a stereo microphone that's on the multi-interface hot shoe that gives her great stereo sound even when it's windy. And I find that I, we just leave the fuzzy thing on all the time because it doesn't hurt the audio when it's not windy. It really doesn't hurt it. And so this is a very versatile camera because we can shoot decent, I like the stills, 12 megapixel stills in extremely low light, and then we can shoot 4K video clips with it. So we'll park it right back in here. I feel like I'm doing an airline commercial. Yeah. Then we have a, a knife here. You always need a, a handy dandy knife. Then I have an iPhone 6S Plus right here, which also will shoot 4K video in a pinch, and also serve as a, a audio recorder in a pinch. So turn around a little bit more this way. We've got some eyeglasses here, reading glasses for people that are blind like me. I have an LED flashlight here. Sometimes you need a little bit of light on the subject. And here I have these lights that turn on that, believe it or not, you can create a nice bokeh for a portrait. If you put this in the foreground and, and blur it and shoot your portrait, you can get some nice bokeh out of that. So those, I've got actually two of those back here. I have back in here the RX100 Mark IV camera that I showed you earlier that we shot the, those other clips with that we've been cutting away to. And then here in this packet, we've got some snacks. Here's an apple pie for Audrey. My favorite. What is that? It's a Lara bar. Actually, it looks German. And it's apple pie, right? My apple pie is my fave. Yeah, because it's sweet, right? Mm-hmm. Audrey, are you going to eat it right now? Yeah. <laughs> Audrey's going to eat the apple pie right now. Mm -hmm. By the way, Audrey's an absolute doll to work with, just so you know. This fuzzy thing here is another microphone. This is a mono microphone that will go on top of the FC-1000 that we're shooting this clip with. And this is handy when it's windy and so forth because of the fuzzy thing on it and gets you a nice directional audio 
if you need that. And that goes down the bottom of this pouch and the camera goes right in on top of that. So I, I don't use that very often, but when I need it, I need it and it's there and it's handy. Because normally if it's breezy or something like that, I just shoot with the other camera and, and that's a stereo mic and so that's what I do. But let's see now. Um, here, this is where this mic and this 10 foot custom Ogami cable came out of. In the front of this, we have, let me put my spectacles on here, because again, I can't see. Um, if I open this, whoops, you probably can't hear me very well because the mic's down there. If I open this in here, I have an extension cable that's tip ring ring sleeve, and then I also have a giant squid microphone here that I can use as a lavalier mic. So I can pin it on Audrey and we can run it back to the camera with this extension cable and we can have a lavalier mic that is wired to the camera and it works pretty good. I also have a stereo giant squid mic that I did a review on my channel on that is really cool that, that will get left and right stereo. It has two different mics on it. Let me put this away. Bear with me there. You asked for all these details so, the, so we're giving you all these details. And free snacks. Okay. All right. So that's Mike's in here. So let me look and see what's in here. In here are business cards and extra batteries. Okay. Spin around. In here are more batteries, an extra Segway key, and more batteries. In here, is another extension cable and the aforementioned giant squid stereo microphone. If I want, for example, what that, where that comes in handy, that lav mic, let's add two people and I want to clip a lav on each one and one standing on the right side, one standing on the left side, you'll actually get some separation on their conversation and you can capture all of that. So let's see what else, turn around. I'm seeing what else I haven't talked about. Okay. Um, I guess that's it. Yeah. What do you all think? Is that it? Is that all we have here in this kit? Oh, no, no, no. Spin around. We got a, a Fisher Space Pen right here. <laughs> Fisher Space Pen. They're so cool because that will sit there for 20 years and never use it and pull it out and it will write. It, they never dry up. They always write every time you try. And I've got a review on my channel of the Fisher Space Pens as well. Um, this thing's almost falling off of you, but hang in there because we're going to do a couple of close-ups. We're going to do a couple of close-ups of some of this gear that we can roll into here as well. And if you have any questions at all, any comments, put them in there. And please, because Audrey put up with this, she was a real sport, <laughs> please subscribe to her channel and share it around and get more subscribers to her channel because she really does put out some fun content. She's not only stunning, beautiful, cute, all of those things, but she's also a lot of fun. Aww. So let me wrap up by saying subscribe to my channel and I've got separate reviews on all of this gear. I've got a product review playlist and if you search Sony, You'll find all my Sony stuff. If you search audio, I'll find, you'll find a bunch of audio stuff that I have that goes with the iPhone as well for getting good audio into that. So I hope this answers all your questions. If it didn't, share in the comments whatever questions, comments you might have, and we will make things happen. Mm -hmm. Thanks for watching, and don't go anywhere. We've got to do a couple of close-ups. Okay, before we get to those close-ups, I want to mention that I also carry in this kit, I forgot to dig it out, it was underneath those uh, candy bars actually, is a ECM W1M wireless mic kit. And that's for the Sony, it goes on the proprietary uh, multi-interface hot shoe, and then it has a receiver that you put place on the talent, and then you can also plug in a lav mic on it. I use the Giant Squid mic plugged into that as a wireless solution. And you'll see I do have reviews on my channel. I always carry that because it's so small and lightweight. If I know I'm going to be doing a lot of wireless stuff and it's important, I also have a Sennheiser, more professional uh, setup that, um, that I'll carry. But they're bulkier and heavier, so I tend to not carry them all the time. But they will fit in this kit. 
And you see in that extra pouch, I can also carry my 70 to 200 f4 lens because it's a lot lighter than the f2.8 Nikon lens that I used to carry. And so sometimes I will carry both the 24 to 70 and the 70 to 200 f4 lens. But usually I pick one or the other depending on the event that I'm covering and how much reach I think I need. Um, so th that's that really rounds out the kit. I'm, I can't really think of anything else important that that I carry on a regular basis but if you do have any questions please share them and to find Audrey go to hoopinglive.com and this thing does not sag down like that on me it's tight around my waist and it works great it just sags down on Audrey because she she is so tiny so anyway thanks for watching and please subscribe to both of our channels and I hope you liked this video let us know if you did thanks again Oh, and one last important thing. Audrey is live Monday nights at 9 p.m. USA Eastern Time on Hooping Live. That's HoopingLive.com.